Hello everyone, it's Barbara and it is Warrior Friday and we are sitting with the light at our back because we are light warriors. Yes, some of us are supposed to be out there fighting and some of us are supposed to be sitting back here being patient because we are supposed to provide sanctuaries. We are supposed to help on the other end of the fighting. So I'm sitting on the other end waiting patiently for um, anybody that needs help, really. So we are light warriors. All right, today we are given a card from the Lightworkers Oracle deck. And Spirit gave us card number 13. And it says, trust in the plan, which is very interesting because um, of all the things that have been going on, you know, we're at the end of January, 2021. And a lot of people thought in the last month that things would be going in a different way. But we have to remember that everything happens for a reason. We might not know what the reason is, but I feel like more people need to wake up. And that's why things are going the way they are. So let's see what the book says about card number 13, which by the way, 13 is a very powerful number, super sacred. Um, I think I've said this before in a video, but I can't remember. So I'm just going to say it. Um, in sacred geometry, the dodecahedron, which is 12 pentagrams. So it's, or excuse me, pentagons. Um, pentagon has five sides and five points and when you put 12 of those together they form a shape called the dodecahedron and when you square five and you square 12 it equals 13 squared and 13 is that that spirit inside in the very center of that dodecahedron. So 13 is a very powerful number. It's the God particle. It's the, it's the spark of light. It's however you interpret what that is in the center. Um, very, very powerful. So card number 13. In preparation for radical growth, there can be temporary disorder and chaos. Whilst the mind may worry that something is going wrong, the spirit knows, by the way, the, the camera's moving because Althea just moved. She was laying underneath it. Um, whilst the mind may worry that something is going wrong, the spirit knows that this is a way for the old to disassemble so the new can be formed. Although you may feel out of control during these times, you do not need to resist the process. There is no need to attempt to impose your own sense of order upon the greater plan. That's that wanting to control things, and we need to let that go. Um, you do not need to seek solutions, for there is no problem here in need of solving. What has been is being cleared away in preparation for the next chapter in your life. Have faith, all is well. And too many times we think, oh, this is broken, I have to fix it. No, it's not necessarily broken. You don't have to fix it. It means it's falling away so that something new and greater can come into being. It's kind of like the tower card in, in tarot. Something has to fall apart and disintegrate so that something new and better can come into play. So the invocation for this card is, I call upon the loving genius of divine order that is manifesting itself in my life. Now, I have gratitude for the grace, compassion, truth, and liberation that is expressing itself through the changes now happening or soon to happen in my life. Thank you for always guiding me onto my truest and most joyful path. I ask through unconditional love for assistance, insight, and support to help me trust in the plan of love unfolding in my life. I ask for the same gift for all living beings and for the earth and the sun, all living beings 
trees, plants, animals. Through divine grace and my own free will, so be it. So be it. So let's just sit back and be patient and put the intention out there that the things that are happening are for everybody's highest and greatest good because then those are the things that will happen. The things that are for everyone's highest and greatest good. Okay, not just mine. Everyone's. So that is the message for today, my beautiful light warriors. May you be blessed with love, light, peace, joy, happiness, success, divine health, and all good things because you are worthy and you deserve them. I love you. Many blessings.